Director Ray, one year ago at this very same hearing, I asked you about the deadliest vehicle crash in decades in my district in upstate New York, the 2018 Schoharie limo crash, instantly killing 20 people. Those families have never been the same, and my office has communicated with many of them. The owner of the illegally retrofitted limo was a longtime FBI informant with a rap sheet a mile long. And it was because of my question to you in this open hearing that the FBI was forced to open an internal review. Let me be clear, that review was in response to our congressional oversight. Since then, that was a year ago, the FBI has stonewalled and slow walked our additional requests for updates on that review until, miraculously, just this week before you knew you were going to appear here today, we received an email informing this committee and myself of the following. The internal review is now complete. The FBI will provide a briefing, and in connection with that briefing, we will make available the internal review with certain redactions. We'll coordinate with your staff regarding the in-camera review of the materials. The FBI is providing this briefing and materials with the understanding that the committee will not publicly disclose the non-public information contained therein. Um, my expectation is that briefing will be this month. Do I have your commitment? Yes. I want to follow up. Can you commit to providing that briefing to those family members, immediate family members, the parents or spouses of those victims? On that one, let me make sure I talk with our folks and circle back with you about what can be shared if there are any limitations. Uh, obviously, we want to make sure that the victims and their families are appropriately informed, but I don't know yet what constraints there may be, so we will follow back up with you on yeah, that. Yeah, they have not been appropriately informed, and it's only because of my work in congressional oversight that they're starting to have sunlight. I believe you're a parent, Chris Ray? Yes, I'm a parent. I'm a new parent as well, and these there is a set of parents that lost three daughters in that crash, so providing sunlight and transparency is important. I also want to note an important portion of the letter that was included. It says, the FBI considers the provision of the internal review as fulfillment of the above reference fence. I remind you that this committee, not the FBI, determines the level of transparency equating to full compliance with our constitutionally directed oversight role. Mr. Chairman, I want to submit this unclassified version of the letter for the record. It's ordered. Uh, I also want to shift gears here regarding Judiciary Committee. I serve on the select subcommittee there, and this committee has made 50 different requests for information and documents concerning the operations and the actions of the FBI. And to date, the FBI has not complied with the Judiciary Committee's long outstanding request for information and documents. The FBI is accountable to Congress and by extension the American people. Responding to this routine oversight is the bare minimum. And today, the FBI failed to send a witness to the Judiciary Committee hearing, saying that we had this hearing happening. Can you commit to sending a witness before the next Judiciary Committee subcommittee hearing on March 28th? We're happy to work with you on making sure we Can make you commit to available. provide a witness? We will, of course, make people available to the committee. But you didn't make people available today. This well, is the base minimum. The agencies need to provide witnesses. Can I get a commitment? Yes, you will provide a witness. We will work with you to make people available. That's not a yes. So for the American people, you are having the FBI director refuse to provide a witness. Just say I'm yes. Not, I'm not refusing to provide a witness. I want to be clear on that. I said we will work with you to make somebody available. So, great. So someone will be made available. Yes. Yes, thank you. That's all I wanted, a yes. Moving forward... Do you believe the Hunter Biden laptop story is disinformation? Well, I want to be careful about it. There is an ongoing investigation that is relevant to that, uh, so I have to be careful of what I can share on that here. Do you believe the Hunter Biden laptop story is disinformation? I, I don't think there's anything I can share on that in open setting. Were you aware that the FBI personnel were in contact with Twitter regarding the Hunter Biden laptop story? I don't believe FBI personnel were in contact with, the, with Twitter about the Hunter laptop story specifically. I think there were people in contact with Twitter about Russian disinformation efforts. Of which the Hunter Biden laptop story was included according to the FBI. Well, I, think, I don't know exactly what you're looking at, but, but I'm happy to talk about what it is the FBI does and does not do with respect to social media companies. Were you aware that the FBI had Hunter Biden's laptop since December of 2019? I can't speak to exactly when we had a laptop available. There is, a, there is as, you, as you know, there is an ongoing investigation run by the U.S. Attorney out of Delaware from the prior administration that we continue to work very closely with. And, and we have Baltimore, an ongoing investigation as well. And our Baltimore field office is working very hard with that U.S. Attorney 
and I expect them to pursue that case uh, as far as it takes. This stonewalling, Director Ray, the American people deserve answers, and this is unacceptable. Lastly, did you sign off on the Mar-a-Lago raid? Uh, well, first off, it was not a raid. It was an execution of a search warrant. Did you second, sign off on the execution second, of the search warrant? If, may I finish? Second, I don't sign off on individual search warrants in that case or in any other. Did Attorney General Merrick Garland sign off to your awareness? I can't speak to the Attorney General. Was there dissent at senior levels of the FBI about the conducting of the, of the search warrant? I can't speak to internal discussions among the FBI or among the FBI and the Department of Justice. Even though it's been reported in the Washington Post. There are lots Multiple. of things reported in the media. I know, a lot leaked of times from your agency. Be, yeah. Leaked from your agency yeah. frequently. It's reported in the and Washington Post. It may or may Post. not be accurate. It may or may not be accurate. With that, I yield back.